Hi guys, and welcome to another episode of Andy Robinson RC. Now, uh, if you remember on our last episode, I was unboxing the Tamiya uh, STEM Educational Kit, the uh, Tamiya Gondola Lift. And uh, I said we were going to build it over the weekend, which we have. And here it is, running in all of its glory. So, uh, what do we reckon of it? Well, um, the night my daughter got home, she wanted to colour in and decorate the sort of the box, as you will, or the the actual gondola lift casing. So she had that coloured in all pretty quick and cut out ready for the next day. Because I said on Saturday uh, we'd build it up, so she was super excited. And then Saturday morning uh, she got ready and added some stickers to finish it off and then we sat on the uh, at the kitchen table and we got ready to build it now um what can i say about it well it was a simple build the instructions were nice and clear as you'd expect from tamia and um yeah it probably took with uh, evelyn doing it as well it probably took about 40 to 40 to 60 minutes to to build it um, and as then she helped grease everything, put all the uh, the cogs on the shafts, uh, put it into the what you class as the the chassis for it. I said greased all the parts, and uh, basically she she built it up. The only thing she had a little help from me was cutting the plastic parts off the sprues, and uh, there's three screws you've got to put in. Now she did screw them in, but I had to finish tightening them up for her. But other than that, she yeah, she pretty much made the entire thing herself. And she did really enjoy it, which was the aim, which was good. But I must say that, um, you know, building it was pretty easy, but actually getting it working correctly like it should do was a bit more of a faff. <laughs> so we, um, we got it ready to go. We put it in a bedroom between a door and some drawers. And it would only work one direction. It would only travel in one direction. So um, I had to strip it down again. And uh, basically what the problem was, was that when the, uh, when the cart hits the stopper, which it's going to do in a sec, and uh, flicks the switch to send the cart the other way, basically it wasn't running in the opposite direction. And the gears, in layman's terms, the gears weren't lining up properly as the switch flicked. So what I had to do is, uh, took all of the chassis to pieces, made sure that the cogs and shafts were all seated properly in the chassis, which I think they were. But I think the main thing is, you had to get all the distances between the cogs and the other cogs correct, as it's, and that seemed to be a bit fiddly. So whether it, when it looked correct that we built it, it turned out that only a couple of millimetres, even less than that, either way. If it wasn't connecting, the switch wouldn't flick it over properly. Anyway, uh, as soon as I realised what it was, we got it sorted. And, as you can see through this little video now, it's uh, travelling left to right. So, it's a success. Now, I asked Evelyn if she liked doing it. She said she did, and I think that was a genuine like. Obviously, I think she liked colouring it all in and uh, making it look pretty but she enjoyed putting it together and she said i want it in my bedroom and can you uh, get it set up in my room so i would class that as a win so would i recommend this for young kids yes on the whole yes i would uh, my daughter certainly enjoyed putting it together and uh, seeing it work but i think you, you just uh, you just need to check everything over twice make sure all the gears are the correct distances apart from each other or as close as they should be and make sure everything is you know fitting in the in the gaps that they should do uh, other than that yeah great stuff so you know i mean i forgot to say in the first video when we got it, it cost about 11 pound this uh, and me personally if you want to get kids interested in how things work with something simple like this, I think it was worth the £11, to be honest. Uh, so there you go. I hope you enjoy that. And 
yeah, why not give it a go uh, with your kids? It's uh, quite cool. So that's the Tamiya gondola lift. And uh, yeah, pretty cool. Right, okay, cheers guys. Thanks for checking this video out. If you consider uh, liking this video, hitting that notification bell and consider subscribing to our channel. There'll be lots more videos coming soon with more RC content, more Tamiya content and uh, hopefully some Lando videos as well. Anyway, uh, take care of yourselves guys. Thanks for checking out the vid and we'll see you soon. Bye.